Okay, it's gonna be a, a lesson on mix, mixing liquors. Uh, when you get liquor, you don't want to just get one because uh, it'll have you in that same state that you're in or whatever country that that liquor comes from. So you want to alchemize it and um, put it get yourself in different countries or different states, whatever it is. But I like to go uh, sometimes in dip, like in the state, like one state inside the country, one or two states. But mainly, I'm learning to do it all different countries around like different um, countries and different continents around the world so uh okay here, here we go but we're gonna start uh with the first one oh my god i got a london dry gin here from bombay i wanted to try i tried the other one which is like a blue one but i want to try the clear one this time so a london dry gin first one okay but we pour it in so i, I really can't Hold of, can't hold of camera and uh, pour at the same time. So let me open it first and then let it pour. All right. There goes the first one. Mixing things to get a outcome. Mixing to get an outcome. Next we have, um, I'm putting in uh, tequila, which is Casamigos. Uh, this is a, a, a white, Blanco means white. This is a white tequila with agave. It's like a honey, so they, it's mixed in together. And this is mixed in with the London dry gin. So you don't want, you can if you want, but you really want to mix the different, uh, the darks with the light liquors. And we have some, uh, one from Germany, the Jägermeister. And we have a Jamaican rum, Appleton Estate. It's another dark liquor. Uh, then we have a, a Jameson. It's an Irish whiskey. So we're hitting all these different countries. It's, it's almost like you're taking a flight to all these countries that you that you mixing in because these are properties of that country those countries too also and we have a gray goose from france uh, a vodka And the last one we have, and this is the seventh one. Hold up, one, two, yeah, this is the seventh bottle, actually. And this is Jack Daniels, what? Number seven. And it's in Tennessee. That's the only one I have that's inside the state or the country of the uh, U.S. So everything else is outside the country. But Tennessee is has, has a specialty. But the crazy thing is uh, Jack Daniels, um, well, the whiskey, Tennessee whiskey was, uh, they always have it. So, uh, another person that made it, but it was actually a, a brother that actually made it, or um, a melanated person, or a so-called black person, or a so-called African American person that actually made it. Uh, I didn't. I should have looked at the name before I got it. I got the, all the liquors together last night, uh, but um, and it's crazy. This is the number, the last one I'm putting in, number seven. But if, if I get a chance, I will look it up one day and f um, find out who the person was he had the recipe and everything for the uh for the whiskey so it goes in with everything so and it's crazy it's like in the center of the country and all those other countries is like surrounding this one so it's gonna be it's pretty close because we got some things to do <laughs> out in tennessee later all right i'm gonna mix this in And you don't have to drink all of all of it at once. No, you don't have to do that. Now you just have a mixture of uh, of something you can either uh, uh, you can drink or you know you can use it for other purposes too. Also, 
So uh, when you uh, you can use it for libations or regardless, or if you have if, if you it'll last a lot lo longer with, by yourself, but with other people, uh, it'll it'll go pretty fast because it's it's like it's not strong, but it's enough. Everything kind of counters each other. Energy, that's what energy does. It goes over when you when you make, you're doing certain things, uh, energy passes over you. Yeah, when you're doing certain things, you're doing the right thing, yeah, they, they, they'll let you know. But uh, back to this. So, that was the last one. Hold on. Okay. Now, they all settled in, but you kind of really want to mix them still. You want to get a good mix of them. Everything has touched each other, but now they're bumping into each other. So, if they're bumping into each other... They're making elbow room for each other. Okay, you hear, you hear, you hear. Okay, you you hear the, you hear too. Okay, cool. Now we can all we can y'all get settled in and get real cozy with each other and make sure it's a, a nice good. It don't have to be the uh, you don't want to like you don't it don't have to be the sweetest taste or whatever. But it's gonna be something different that you originally uh, when you get like these big bottles. That's like your mind state pretty much is where it's at. So you actually can you can go. And get any all the liquors and then mix some different types of liquors together. And people don't like to mix the dark with the uh, uh, the white liquors at all. So you know, once I start figuring this out, you really don't get messed up like that. You can just sip a little bit, and most of these are like 40 uh, proof, and I think it's like one or two of those like 80 proof. But you know it kind of mellows it out, and it's not uh, to the point where you just you know falling off your all off your ass and nothing like that. But if you drink a lot of it, you can. But it just have you feeling nice. It's just like putting you in different parts of the world or different parts of your mind. You just opening these things up. All right. And since it was seven bottles, seven minutes.